view of the National Mall and the Memorial Parks that contain some of the oldest protected park plans of the National Park Service. Coming up on our left, the East Wing of the National Gallery, focusing on modern and contemporary art, with a collection of works by Picasso, Matisse, Pollock, Andy Warhol, Roy Lichtenstein, and Alexander Calder, among others. Right now, we stop at the red light. Right now, we're going to continue our journey. And right now, we're driving down. And right now, my battery is about to die. And right now, I... No. The Canadian Embassy showcases oh, aspects I saw. of Canada's artistic... There's my embassy right there. ...including the performing arts, literature, film, video and Not television, and a 175-seat theater. Next to the Canadian Embassy, you'll find the museum. It is a 250,000-square-foot big museum featuring seven levels of galleries, theaters, retail space, and visitor services. It is the world's most interactive museum and offers a unique environment that takes its visitors behind the scenes to experience how and why news is made.